certainly are. I mean, in the Sunnyville Williams case, he's uh, never played the game of seven, so he's just thirsting for information, and uh, he's certainly taking a lot in and, and certainly performed really well over these last three days. I mean, he's got a challenge and a dream and a goal, and it's to go to the Olympics and to be the best he can be. And uh, even though he's an All Black and a uh, World Cup winning All Black on a couple of occasions, uh, this game of sevens is new to him, but it's exciting times, and uh, he is nervous, but uh, he's also coming into this camp with a lot of confidence. To be in here for a few days, I've got so much admiration for these guys, you know. I've been doing this for a long time and uh, um, it's not easy work. I thought the pre-season of uh, Rugby League was tough. Uh, my days in Rugby League were tough, but uh, here it's a whole new ball game. So uh, I, I watched um, a lot of sevens last year and just uh, seeing, you know, some of the magical things they can do on the field. But then, you know, when you get to meet them up close and they're just good dudes, um, you know, it's pretty overwhelming because, you know, you're a little bit starstruck, so to speak. Yeah, well, the first day we got him, we did a beep test. And, uh, you know, usually in our franchise, we do a beep test. It's not too much after that. But then we came out here for, I think it was a hour hour of fitness games. And after 20 minutes, um, I was uh, I couldn't get out of a jogging pace. So, um, you know, it was a bit of a wake-up call. First and foremost, he needed to, to find a position and where are you going to play me, Titch? And uh, I'm looking to play him in the forwards. But at the same time, we've got different phases and different games where we'll put him into the backs as well. They look up to him. You know, he is a superstar, but uh, he knows he's got to work as hard as anyone to make this side.